Welcome to Infigyan, my dear friends. Today in this video, we have one very interesting exponential equation problem which we will be solving for real values of x. So let's get started by writing here our base is a, our exponent is b. So we can write our equation a power b equal to 1. Now this is one specific form if we want to solve such kind of exponential equation where a power b is equal to 1 then we can write here three cases from where we can get our solutions. Case number 1 if our base is 1 and our power is real number then we are going to get RHS 1. This is our case number 1. Now case number 2, if our power is 0, but we have to make sure our base should not be 0, otherwise we will get 0 power 0. So that is not defined. So in this case also we are going to get RHS 1. Third case is, if our base is negative 1 and our power is even number. So minus 1 with even power will give us 1. So which is our RHS. Now we have to solve our equation under these three cases. So let me write here case number 1. A is equal to 1. B should be real. This is our A. This is our B. So let me write x square minus 10x plus 26 over 5 equal to 1. Now we will multiply both sides by 5. So x square minus 10x plus 26 equal to 5. Take all the terms to LHS. x square minus 10x. 26 minus 5 is 21 equal to 0. Now we can use method of factorization and split minus 10x as minus 3x minus 7x plus 21 equal to 0. From first two terms x is common. From last two minus 7 is common equal to 0. So factorization will become x minus 3 times x minus 7 equal to 0. Now we can use product 0 rule. So we can write either x minus 3 equal to 0 or x minus 7 equal to 0. So we have two real solutions x equal to 3 x equal to 7. Now we have to make sure our power should be real number. So let us check b of 3 this should be real and b of 7 this should also be real number. If I will write here the b value b is x square minus 6x plus 5. So b3 will be 3 square minus 6 times 3 plus 5. 3 square is 9. 9 plus 5 is 14 minus 6 times 3 is 18 minus 4 which is real number. So 3 is true solution. Now we will check B7. 7 square minus 6 times 7 plus 5. 49 plus 5 54 minus 42. Value will be 12 which is real number. Hence our solution 7 is also true. Now we will take up case number 2. Case 2 is our power is 0 this time. Base is non-zero. So we will check once we will find the values of x from this equation. We will check from second whether it is 0 or non-zero. So let me put b equal to 0 here. Here we have b. 
So I will write here b equal to 0 x square minus 6x plus 5 equal to 0. Now we can factor easily. We can split minus 6 as minus x minus 5x plus 5 equal to 0. x is common x minus 1 in the bracket minus 5 is common x minus 1 in the bracket equal to 0. So we can write our factorization x minus 1 times x minus 5 equal to 0. Using product 0 rule, we'll be getting 2x values 1 and 5. Now we have to check a1, a5. These values should not be equal to 0. Let's find out a1 first. A is here. So I will write a1 equal to 1 square minus 10 times 1 plus 26 over 5. So 26 plus 1 is 27 minus 10 over 5. Value will be equal to 17 over 5 which is non-zero. So our solution 1 is true. Now we will find a5. I will write here 5 is square minus 10 times 5 plus 26 divided by 5. So 25 plus 26 is 51 minus 10 times 5 is 50 divided by 5. We are going to get 1 over 5 which is non-zero. So our solution 5 is also verified. So far we have 1, 5, 3 and 7. 1, 3, 5, 7. Now we will take up case number 3. Case number 3. Here our base is negative 1. And our power should be even numbered. So this is our A. This is our B. Let me put a equal to negative 1 first. So I will write here x square minus 10x plus 26 over 5 equal to minus 1. Now we will cross multiply and write x square minus 10x plus 26 equal to minus 5. Take all the terms to LHS x square minus 10x, 26 plus 5 is 31 equal to 0. Now this is one quadratic equation and we are going to calculate real solutions only. So I can check our discriminant value d which is as per formula I am writing in caps letter b square minus 4ac. As per our equation, a is coefficient of x square 1, b is coefficient of x minus 10, c is constant 31. Let's find out discriminant b square minus 10 square minus 4 times 1 times 31. Value will be equal to 100 minus 124 which will be equal to minus 24. Our discriminant is negative. Conclusion is complex solutions are there. Complex solutions. So we can reject our case number 3. This case is rejected. So from our case 1 and case 2, 3, 7 and 1, 5. So I can write here there are only four solutions 1, 3, 5, 7 for our exponential equation. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye bye.